All right, temperatures run away above average for this time of year. Kind of the grand finale, the peak of the high pressure ridge. It's been in place the last couple of days. Here's a look at today's high temperatures. 59 up on Hopi, 62 Winslow, 63 in Sedona, 54 for us here in Flagstaff. Nine degrees above the average of 45 degrees for this time of year. So one of the earliest 70 degree record uh, temperatures we've ever hit back in 1976. Seven. Um, all right, well, things are going to start to change up for us. Beginning tomorrow, Pacific Storm System beginning to take shape, and here it is out in the Pacific, and this thing's really going to strengthen here over the next 24 hours. If you uh, have a satellite at home and you're so inclined, watch this thing turn into a huge beast of a storm off of California tomorrow. Notice these clouds out ahead of it will start to filter in for us tonight. We may even see a little bit of rain up towards the Arizona, Utah border, and tomorrow morning early, some of this way out ahead of of it moisture. Some of this moisture way out ahead of the storm system will uh, bring some light rain during the morning hours, but uh, the main storm system really doesn't move in for us until Saturday. There's been some changes with the forecast track on this storm. This is what we've been talking about all week. It looked like the storm was going to take a southerly track down into Mexico today. Models changing their tune a little bit and shifting this thing a little bit north tomorrow off San Francisco, Saturday a little bit more north off Baja and Sunday moving through Arizona. So what does this mean? Well, with the more southerly track, it was going to be warmer and less in the way of precipitation. Now with a more northerly track, colder and more in the way of precipitation. Some of the storm highlights tomorrow, some light rain in the morning. I think Saturday we see snow showers down around Flagstaff early in the morning with little accumulation, rain showers as uh, the snow levels will actually rise through the day on Saturday. Then Sunday, it looks to be all snow down to around 6,500 feet with several inches of snow in the forecast. Previous forecast, when we looked at it, notice uh, there was a one-inch bullseye across the southern desert locations and just barely the blues around an inch of moisture making its way into northern Arizona around Flagstaff. Well, today, look at the new model forecast on the moisture. Look at all the blue across Arizona with a three-inch bullseye across uh, portions of Yavapai and Gila County. Still the heaviest moisture south of the Mogollon Rim, but these blues now making their way into uh, much of northern Arizona, including us here in Flagstaff. So it's going to be a wet weekend for sure and a few inches of snow as well. And I think the most likely time to see some snow around Flagstaff will be Saturday night and through the day on Sunday. The storm will be out of here by President's Day Monday with a quick return to some mild temperatures. Okay, here's a closer look at the satellite. Some rain moving into Southern California. As I mentioned, some rain in the forecast overnight tonight across far northern Arizona. Some early morning rain as far south as Flagstaff. And then during the day, I think we break out and we're partly cloudy and uh, no rain through much of the bulk of the day tomorrow. 32 degrees overnight tonight as the high clouds are on the increase tomorrow. Look for the light morning drizzle and uh, otherwise partly cloudy as I mentioned. Much cooler, 44 degrees our high temperature forecast tomorrow 57 for Sedona to round out the work week 55 in Prescott 56 Payson no rain tomorrow down across the southern half of the state that's all going to happen on Saturday and uh, quite a bit of it as well we could see some uh, flooding concerns as well with two three inches of rain okay here's our extended forecast Going through the weekend, temperatures cool. It's a little snowy early Saturday, turning to rain through the day on Saturday as warm air gets pumped in up ahead of the storm system. I don't think we see much in the way of any snow accumulation until Saturday night into Sunday, maybe two to three inches. Up on the San Francisco peaks where it'll all be snow. Great news for skiers, foot plus, foot, foot and a half of snow on the way.